Hi everyone, this video will demonstrate creating a schematic page in Visio. So as you can see, we're down on the schematic view tab uh, of a Visio project. I'm going to click the project editor and I'm going to find what I want to drag over here. So we'll expand this list and I'm going to pull over this and this. Drag them and drop them. And these are going to drop the shapes here with the inputs and outputs listed for the devices. And of course that's pulling from the shape data. If I double click this product, it'll open up the edit product form. If you go to the IOs tab, you'll see the inputs and outputs for this device. Go ahead and close that. And we're going to want a wire over here in order to make a connection. So we'll go back to the project editor and we'll do a quick search here. Let me see if I can find the wire I'm looking for. We'll pull over this one. It's going to drop on the page. I'm going to pull this down and show you the wire shape that dropped. So where these shapes come from, um, click here for shapes. The wire shape that dropped is a finished wire, as you see here. And the schematic shapes pulled from this stencil. Here you can see a schematic shape here. And there's a horizontal option if you would like to switch these to horizontal. And speakers will drop a slightly different shape on this page as well. But uh, you can then make wire connections. Connect that there connect this right here, and you've made a wire connection inside of Visio. Uh, this wire connection will report back to our installation reports. And uh, I've got a, one more thing to show you here, a little bit about this wire itself. Now uh, the reason these ends are showing is that's a default setting in the software. It shows like a graphic representation of the uh, start terminal and end terminal that have been assigned to the wire. I'll double click this to show you that. If you open up this wire and go here to the specifications, you can see that a start terminal and an end terminal have been set. And for all of your major connections, there will be an icon representation, um, as long as this field is entered for that wire. And uh, if you don't like that and you would just rather have like an arrow wire or just um, a, should say a line uh, with an arrow or a line with no arrow, um, of course you can um, not assign those ends or you can turn off that setting here. If you look here at the project settings, project settings, you come over to connections, you'll see here uh, display line and images in Visio for start terminal and end terminal. You could uncheck that if you don't like that option. And uh, let me show you a finished Visio, uh, sorry, sorry, Visio schematic here. Let's go here. And in this project, we've gone ahead and just wired up this a uh, couple of different systems for this project.